Now here's something that you might not know about taking on debt. The debt with a lower monthly payment might actually be the debt that costs you more money over your lifetime. Hi, I'm Sheng from Save My Sense. I am a multimillionaire and early retired in my 30s, and I'm here to teach you about personal finance soup to nuts. Today, we're going to learn about installment loans. What are installment loans? Some very common examples are mortgage loans and student loans. And these loans are called installment loans because they apply the same monthly payment over time to help you pay off the loan over a certain period of time. Installment loans are different from, say, revolving loans, which is what credit card loans are, which is you can have access to a certain amount of credit. You can borrow up to that amount at any time and then pay off using different amounts at all times. So let's go back to the question that I first posed. How could it be that a loan with a lower monthly payment could actually end up costing you more money? Well, there's three parts to a loan that I need you to know in order to understand how an installment loan works. These three parts are the balance that you owe, the interest rate on the loan, and the term, which is the total amount of time in which you have to get the loan paid off. Let's start with a very simple example of a $10,000 loan. So this $10,000 is your balance. Let's also, to make lives a little easier for us to use the same interest rate in both examples, I'm going to use 5% as the interest rate. Now, most loans are compounded on a monthly basis, meaning that you're going to owe a monthly payment. But just for my illustration, I'm going to do it once a year. So this loan is going to have an annual payment. Now this is where the difference happens. I'm going to show you the math for a loan that takes 10 years to pay off versus a loan that takes 20 years to pay off. The $10,000 loan with the 5% a year interest rate over 10 years is going to have an annual payment of $1,295. The $10,000 loan with 5% interest over 20 years is going to have an annual payment of $802. So at first you'd be like, wow, the loan with the $802 annual payment is lower. That should be the better deal. That's going to be the, the debt that I'm going to pick. The way that these installment loans work is that over time, as you make your monthly payment, some of the monthly payment goes towards interest. Some of it goes towards paying down your principal balance. When the loan term, the amount of time that you have to pay back the loan gets longer, more interest is applied against your loan balance. So even if the term looks longer and your monthly payments look less, in fact, you're actually paying a lot more in interest. I'm going to show you the math next. So now you can see the table with the loan that's over 10 years. And you're going to see the first column shows the payment going towards the loan balance. And the second column is the loan payment that goes towards paying down the interest. Over the course of the 10 years, you're going to pay $2,950 towards the interest on this loan. Now we have another table and this shows the 20 year loan again with the money going towards the balance in the first column and the money going towards the interest in the second column. In this example, the 20 year loan is going to cost you over $6,000 in interest payments. So even though the monthly payments seem less, you're actually doubling the amount of money that you're sending to the interest on these loans. So be very careful and read the terms when you sign up for loans and really understand what you're signing up for. And at the end of the day, I hope that you always make it a plan to get debt free, to pay off your loans early if possible.